Hey, this squad. Welcome back to episode of Is It Worth It? So today's episode has this cool image right here, and pretty much what this is, is a laser hair removal. So the cool thing about this one is the fact that it actually has a very cool technology built in that a lot of other ones do not have, which is a cooling functionality. So that way when you guys are using it, it won't just like burn your skin with the uh, laser that's being used, but also give you guys that cooling effect to cool down your skin or the hair after you guys do use it, which is really awesome. So if you see it on the bottom right here, they do probably got some specs and features about the product. So they mentioned how it actually has a lifetime use. It has a full body hair removal option and it has the cooling or ice cooling option. And if you guys turn on side right here, they do probably got some specs and features about the product in terms of where you guys can use it and some of the benefit of uh, how to actually use it as well. So they mentioned how you can use it for your armpit, your lips, arm, leg, bikini, back, or anywhere else. And on the side right here, they show you guys how to actually use it. So week one, week two, week three, and etc. They mentioned how if you guys follow the steps correctly in terms of how often to use it, after eight weeks, you should be remove all the hair that you guys want. And they also mentioned on the side right here that I just show you guys, after eight weeks, you don't need to actually use it anymore until like one to two months. If you guys do see hair starting growing out again, but here is what the package looks like when you guys do get it. Let me open up to show you guys what the inside looks like. So once you guys open up, this is what the inside looks like. So first the inside, they do probably guys use a manual to teach you guys how to set up and how to use it. And they show you guys what skin level, if you guys have certain uh, skin type, you don't want to use it. So you definitely want to make sure to look at this before you use it. Next step right here, they do probably guys a quick starter guide to teach you guys how to set it up and how to use it. And also what's included. So you definitely want to make sure you have where the goggle that's included to actually uh, protect your eyes because it is laser. But when I needed that, and we see we do have everything else. So let's take everything out. So the first box right here, we do have the cable for the plug in to recharge the product. Maybe to even activate the product. We'll find out in a second. Next step right here, they do probably got a trimmer option, probably for you guys to shave your hair first before you guys do use it. Because probably if you guys want to get like the best benefit or the faster result of it, you probably want to shave it first to make it more thin. So that way the uh, laser actually works a lot easier. And then right here, they do probably got the glasses or the goggle. So this is what it looks like. If I do put it on, this is what the product will look like once you guys do put it on to give you guys that protection from the laser. And then last but not least, we do have the actual product. So if I do take it out, this is what the product looks like. So here is the front, here is the side, here is the back, here is this side, and then here is this side. So this side right here is where you guys want to put your arm or wherever when you guys do use it because that's where the laser is going to happen. Top part right here is the display screen to show you guys what you guys are using and which different mode and etc. This is probably the button for you guys to press. So that's probably the flashing button. Right here we do have the button for it to turn on and here we do have the cooling button. In the middle right here it shows you guys the skin sensor in terms of what your skin is when you guys do use it. Right here in the back is pretty much the ventilation option to prevent it from overheating when you guys do use it. And the other thing that I forgot to mention is right next to the laser right here, this plate right here is a cooling plate to give you guys that cooling effect when you guys do use it. So that way your skin is not burning when you guys do use the product. And right here on the side is the outlet for you to plug it in to actually use it. And that is pretty much everything that's on the product. So what I'm doing right now is to try to turn it on to see when actually it works before I should plug in cable to see when actually it works uh, wireless. So if I do turn it on, it doesn't look like it works. So you probably have to plug in cable to actually use it. So safety first, let's put on goggle just in case. And I want to plug in the cable. So let's plug it on the side right here. Once you guys do plug it in, if you guys do turn it on, if you see right here, I show you guys that's off. But if you guys do press the on button right here or the power button, it does turn on. And if it's in here, immediately the fan turns on. And right here, I show you guys a blue indicator light. So if you guys ever forget about what the color represents on here, you guys can look at the instruction manual. Let me turn off for now. So when I do turn it off, you have to press and hold it for a few seconds in order for you guys to turn it off. But let me show you the piece of paper first. So this is the chart you guys want to refer to when you guys do use it. So if you guys do have like white hair, gray hair, red hair, like golden hair, or if you guys have a different skin color based on right here, you don't want to use it. Anything below right here is when you guys want to use it for a different level that they show you guys as well. But let's turn it back on. If you guys press right here, it turns on the ice option. And literally how it works is that you just want to put it against your skin onto your hair and it starts working. If you guys press on that button again, it turns it off. And now it only has like the regular laser option without the ice option. If you guys press on this button, that's the flashing button. 
So obviously nothing works until you guys actually put your hair on here and start using it. So I'm actually turning off for now. So that's pretty much how you guys do use it. And if you guys ever forget about what a different button is for, they do mention on here as well. So they mentioned for the function button or the flash button right here. If you guys short press it, that turns on a menu mode. If you guys long press it, that turns on auto mode. If you guys press on the flash button again, it'll turn off the auto mode. And then for the power button, when you guys do press it, after you guys do turn on, you guys can change the energy level from one to five. Let me show you guys what I mean. So if I do press on one time, you can see the energy level on there. So for the first time using product, you definitely want to make sure you guys use it on level one and get used to it first. And it's very important for you guys to shave your hair first before I do use it. But just for this test, I want to test it out and show you guys how it does work. So let's give it a try. So just for this test, I'm not going to shave myself before I should use it, but you definitely want to before you guys do. I just want to show you guys what happens when you guys do use it. So let's do turn it on. Turn the ice mode. And what you guys want to do is press and hold this button right here if you guys want to use auto mode. So once you guys see that symbol right there or that logo, that is how you guys know that the auto mode is on. So all you do now is just put it against the skin. So for example, I go like this, it will flash. So you definitely want to make sure you guys have this on. So just like that. And when you guys have the cooling option on, it'll be really helpful. So you definitely want to be careful when you guys do use it. Like once it sense like your skin or once it sense like the hair it knows. You can see, and it's still blue. So that means it's pretty good for now. But if the longer you guys leave it, the color probably change. And the number as you see how it goes down. But the flash on here is actually really strong because of the laser that's on here. You can see, I can definitely notice some of my hair already is gone already. But like I mentioned, it's really important for you guys to shave first before I still use it to get the best benefit of like the laser hair removal. So I want to turn it off for now. But just by using it just now, I can definitely feel a little bit of that burn already. But having that the cooling option or the ice cooling functionality is actually really helpful. And definitely wearing the glass is actually really helpful as well because that flash is actually really bright if you can see. So that is pretty much how you guys do the product. If you can see, it actually works pretty well, but in order for me to see the result, I have to keep constantly using it. For me personally, I like keeping my hair, so I probably won't use this, but I'll definitely keep this in the future to probably use it if I ever want to lose my hair. I don't see the reason why I want to lose my hair because I am a man and I want to keep my hair the way it is. But if you guys want to lose any hair, especially if you have a female, if you guys want to have that like hairless look, then you guys can definitely use one of these. But I mean, see what we do is a product, it definitely works pretty well and very easy for you to use it. But that is everything that's on the product. Now to come boxing and testing product. Now to answer the question of whether or not it's worth it or not. So for this part, I do have to say that it's pretty worth it if you guys want need one of these, especially if you guys are in the market looking for a high quality laser hair removal device that also give you guys the cooling functionality built in as well, then I do have to say that it's pretty worth it. 